Do these blood tests also find, uh, tests that you do find things like toxins in our blood oh, as yes. well? And, and what can be done? Well, one that? of the things we do is we take hair, okay. or if a person colors their hair, we use urine. We send that to our lab in Chicago and they look at 30 toxic elements, mercury, cadmium, lead, arsenic, uranium, and all of that. And uh, we can come up with the toxic part of it. Uh, there are also other ways to see toxins like an elevated albumin. Now, if the albumin is low, that means the cells are deteriorating and decreasing. And that's a real dangerous sign. And people die, they have an albumin of about three or 3.2 and they should have about 4.6. So the albumin gives a little clue about the breakdown of the cells. And uh, I think just looking at each of these chemistries in a whole new way, the BUN, BC ratio, the creatinine, the kidney, mm -hmm. the GGTP, which most doctors don't even order, that would be the gallbladder, bile duct. I should have bought my book so I could show it. <laughs> but my book has all this stuff in it in great detail. And I ordered too many books. So now I'm, I, that was selling them for $40. I am now selling them for $20. So uh, that book has everything in it that I'm talking about and more. It's about 50 pages long, always in beautiful color for 20 bucks.